Hey YouTube. First of all, for a little housekeeping. Smoking my Mark V. It's a US made pipe. I don't know who makes them. Good smoke. Hangs pretty good. But, um,. I wanted to share my two new acquisitions. This is a Anderson. And it is pretty cool. Look, look. finger go way down in there. Nice big bowl. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of bright out here, so. My phone really didn't do justice. And bent brandy. Right, turn around this other way. Yeah. The bowl. Yeah. Anyway, just got finished cleaning them. Uh, smoking. The last bit of this tin, Balkan Sobrani. That one's done. If you hadn't had a chance to buy it or get it, you need to. As far as the Balkan blend, it is absolutely fabulous. That's one of my favorites. It's a cool smoke. It's a lot of Kia blend. Nice balking. I was looking at my subscriber list. I have 99 subscribers. So it looks like I'm about to flip over to 100. Which I need to come up with a 100 subscriber contest. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But being as being as it's close, I should go ahead and kick it off, but I need to think about the contest. I want something unique, a little different. Somebody mentioned a trade contest. But I don't know how a trade contest would work. So I'll give it some thought. I'll probably contact a couple of you guys. Uh, I talk to on a, a regular basis. See what you think. It's my last day off. I'll go back to work in the morning. Of course, I'll be off Saturday, too, here in Grayson, Georgia. Well, actually, I live in Snellville, just outside Atlanta. I'm not Snellville, I'm sorry, Loganville, just outside Atlanta. Grayson has what they call Grayson Days. It's from 10 o'clock in the morning until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. They have arts, crafts, a little festival going on, parade. And, of course, our lodge is doing barbecue. My little dog. I don't know if you see him. He's eating decking. <laughs> I feed him. He's not hungry. Now that's my other one. It's my mini pen over there. That's Dakota. Hey, Dakota Bear. Yeah, that's one of them. And my little Chihuahua. Those guys are two peas in a pod. When they get together, you gotta watch out, they plot on you. I love these dogs. My wife's dog's in here somewhere. It's a little multi poo, about two and a half pounds. A little fluff ball, white fluff ball running around. But, uh, enough of me rambling.
to all you guys. I appreciate the subscription so far. If you hadn't had a chance to get out to uh, Stash Warden, he has some really nice work. His artwork is, is fabulous. I'm thinking about maybe commissioning a, a painting from him of a dog that I had to have put to sleep about eight months ago. Had her for 16 years. Love that dog. And uh, thought about maybe, you know, have a, a nice painting fix with her. But, you know, that's life. I've got a couple unique tampers already finished. I'm working on a different way of putting the woods together. Something I've never done before. I've actually never made tampers before. And uh, that first one I showed you was, was huge. And it was just an idea that I had. Uh, you know, a tamper and then on the other side having maybe a stamp or a seal that you could stamp or seal envelopes with. Something that's really nice for somebody's desk. Um, but these others would be really, would be a lot smaller. Uh, they could fit in your bowl. And I noticed a lot of, uh, some people that sent me tampers have used their native coin um, of their country. So what I thought about doing is use some coin of my country. Uh, I have a ton of old silver coins that add a little bit of value to it. Let me see if I can. It's hard to uh, do this stuff in one hand. My pipe ladder took a shit on me, so it don't work. Except right on Mr. Big. I don't know. This, uh, how's that? Is that better? I don't know. These iPhones, certain way light gets it, it messes everything up. So. Hi right, YouTube, I'm going to work on a contest, but it'll have to be somebody that's uh, subscribed to my channel, have to have a video response, and um, oh, uh, Hobby Pipes again, buddy, thank you for the three nuns and the Mick McQuaid, I've smoked them both, uh, I like the three nuns. I let my brother sample it. He loved the three nuns. And the Mick McQuaid, I thought, was uh, even better. It's, a, it's an absolutely great flake. And, of course, both of them you can only get in England. So, anyway, y'all have a good one, and uh, stay tuned. See you later.